I work out every day. It's part of what I do. It's my stress relief. Christina Pampa runs every day, so when she noticed her calf was swollen, she figured it was a running injury. If I were to compare both my calves, it probably was about like an inch bigger in circumference um, than my other one. And I just thought it was muscular. But after two weeks of discomfort, she went to get help. I went to my physical therapist to see what he could do to help me. And he looked at it and instructed me to go to the emergency room immediately that he suspected I had a blood clot. It was something that Mercy Medical Center's Dr. Paul Lucas says can be potentially dangerous. Up to almost 100,000 people will die from them. And that's usually related to a venous thromboembolism or pulmonary emboli that can get into the lungs. He says that's why it's so important to see a doctor. Persistent redness and swelling is often a sign. If it lingers, you should really get it checked out. Dr. Lucas has a long list of risk factors, age, obesity, immobility, smoking. Those are just a few examples. It's a good conversation to have with your primary care doctor. You know, hey, what are my risks? And am I at risk for a potential blood clot? But he stresses anyone can get a blood clot. Christina is an example of that. No one's out of that category. It could happen to anyone. She says she's grateful to be running again. She pays close attention to her body and hopes this story will help others do the same.